How about this? How about no fake pregnancy announcements on April Fool's Day? Most of us were just pretending to be excited when we thought you were really pregnant, so just to trick us into feigning that kind of concern just adds insult to injury. Shout out to all of my haters. I understand exactly where you're coming from, and I have many of the same concerns that you do. Reed Hastings in 1997 got the idea for Netflix when he returned his copy of Apollo 13 to Blockbuster with a late fee of $40. Now, a lot of people think that this is a great story of the entrepreneurial spirit, but I think it's the most elaborate revenge plot ever. When you're on the internet as much as I am, you sort of find it impossible to have the emotional capacity to care about literally everything all at once, but there's no shortage of people letting you know that that makes you a terrible person. So. Here's a little known fun fact. The name Mickey is actually a hypocrisy of the forename Michael, which means America's favorite animated mouse is actually named Michael Mouse. Spinning rapidly in circles is a childhood equivalent to drinking alcohol. How about this? How about you're not allowed to buy a home in a residentially zoned area unless you plan on living in it yourself? How come landlords are the only ones that can own a business in a residentially zoned area? I can't open up a Chick-fil-A drive-through in my driveway. I submit that Paul Bunyan is a kaiju, and I want to see him fight Godzilla. I said what I said. Look, I'm not saying Irish step dancing is easy, but it's a dance where nothing above the knee moves, so compared to other dance styles, yeah, Irish step dancing is easy. All right, so cards on the table. What is the metaverse? What are people even buying? Anytime somebody talks about it, it just sounds like a rich guy trying to sell me a bridge in Narnia. I have one irrational fear and one irrational fear only. That's contortionists. That's it, that's the whole video. Goddamn rubber people, get some bones! Okay, 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 check it out. A wingman, but for like, making friends over 30. <laughs> the NFT of the first ever tweet that originally sold for $48 million just went up for auction again and guess where it topped out? 280 bucks. <laughs> I can't wait to see how your dumb apes fare on the open market. Everybody told you! How pissed do you think Jesus would be to find out that we call the date of his death a Good Friday? Come to think of it, we use the device of his torture to symbolize him. That's messed up. Jesus washed the feet of the poor all the time. Couldn't we use a bowl or something? Do you think dogs know that their front paws are their hands and their back paws are their feet? Or do you think that they just think that they're all feet? I don't know why I need to know this, but I need to know. When Jesus passes out and comes back three days later, he's the Messiah. But when I do it, I'm an alcoholic and I'm ruining the Easter egg hunt for everybody. So I just found out that cows actually do sleep lying down instead of what I previously thought, which was cows always slept standing up. And consequently, every one of my high school friends that said they've been cow tipping have revealed to be liars. I love my wife. She's definitely a ride or die chick. I mean, we're gonna have to stop every 15 minutes for her to go to the bathroom, but you know, she's in the car. You see, I don't think that presidents should have Twitters because they're always tweeting things like, we need universal health care, or we need to lower the cost of medicine. Like bro, you are the most powerful person in the free world. Who are you tweeting at, Katy Perry? Lots of you on here like to trauma dump about how your parents screwed up your life, but you often forget about how you ruined theirs. Your mom was hot and wanted to travel the world, and she ended up chasing you around the house trying to trick you to eat dino nuggies so you wouldn't die. Who got the short end of the stick here? So spring is here, summer is approaching, and I have to say, I'm really excited for weather that makes me self-conscious about my body in comparison to Instagram models in a different way. You know? I want to see the movie The Northman, but I'm a little afraid that I'm going to be in a theater with a bunch of racists. What is it about Norse culture that attracts all the racists? One fun thing to do when someone asks when you're going to start having kids is to look them dead in the eye with a blank face and say, when are you going to stop? Sometimes I think liberals need to understand the difference of when something is like technically true and effectively true. Like, yeah, money isn't real. That's technically true. But effectively, that's not the case, right? Pain isn't real either. But when I punch you in the face, effectively, it's real. You see, the problem with the company LaCroix insisting that it's pronounced LaCroix instead of the French pronunciation LaCroix is that they insist on naming their flavors after French words. Like, is this Cerise Lemon or is it pronounced Cherise Lion? There's some people out there that are like, oh, I don't drink alcohol because I'm allergic to it. Now, I'm not a doctor, right? I don't want to make fun of your medical condition. This is the internet after all. But aren't we all allergic to alcohol? Like, it's poison. That's, that's why we drink it. You see, I think Republicans would be for forgiving student loan debt, since the government owns like 92% of it, and oh, I don't know, that seems like big government to me. Plus, there'd be more money in the economy to invest in your wife's skincare product line, which, you know, isn't a pyramid scheme. I think you should be able to stitch advertiser content on TikTok. Like what, you want to be part of this community, but you don't want to be dunked on by a 19-year-old liberal arts major? Psh, lame.
All right, so I understand that sexual dimorphism is when two genders of the same species present differently, but someone needs to explain to me how monomorphic species aren't having, like, same-sex relations at least half the time. Because Christians are always like, oh, this isn't natural, and I'm like, it seemed like it would happen pretty naturally.